to me, like I, I Izakai is just like my number one kind of drinking establishment that I enjoy throughout the world. I mean, it's the, anywhere it's the easiest, it's the chillest. It's the chillest, you know. You always, it's always nice. All foreigners love it because it's so easy. You press the little button. Sometimes yeah. it's all you can drink. Oh yeah, because you, you, you don't have to order at the bar. Never either. have to order at the never bar. At the, no. Never order at the bar. I will order say that is a hundred times better than the yeah. UK. You all order all your food and drinks from a tablet. There's yeah. no pressure to go order at the bar and they just bring it to you. Uh, there is uh, one of my favorite izakai as I go to a lot with my uh, other friends is uh, it's one in Ikebukuro. Uh, I don't know what it's called anymore. It used to be called Kobayashi's. I think I took you guys there. I don't remember. Kobayashi's but basically it's it's like, it's uh, on the west side of Ikebukuro and it's mm. underground and like, it's like it's exactly like an izakaya. Mm. So it has like food and everything, but you pour your own drinks. Oh yeah, I think yeah, I've yeah, been to yeah, that yeah, one yeah, as yeah. well. And there's yeah. like a huge like tub, like it's like a fucking barrel full of miso shiru, like miso soup. And it's just all you can drink miso soup as well. And it's the best fucking thing ever. Cause it's just like, cause miso soup is like the ultimate hangover drink in my yeah, opinion. Yeah. Right. Cause like another thing I want to talk about when it comes to dra- Japanese drinking culture is nomi hodai. Oh which yeah, is, um, all, you can drink. all you can drink. Which anytime you, anytime <laughs> someone from England or like, <laughs> or like America or someone comes here yeah. and they see how many, like they, they learn about the all you can drink culture here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, Boys, I'm I'm moving here. I'm I'm coming out every nine track. Every Australian I've taken to a Normie holiday has always either been like, so is there like a drink limit? <laughs> or, or they're like, oh, it's only for like 10 minutes, right? Like it's like happy hour, right? Yeah. It's like, no, you can do it for as long as you want. They're just yeah. like, uh, how, like how, how, how much is like a typical Normie holiday? Oh, uh, 1500 for a 30 minutes, is it? No, an no, hour, no, an no. Hour. It's cheaper than that. It depends which ones you go. Either, either it's like I've seen like two thousand yen for two hours. Yeah, I, I think yeah. it's it's about so it's about twenty bucks for two hours of all you it can drink. It depends where you go, yeah. but generally it's around that price. Yeah, yeah, around that price. And compared to like everywhere you see in England and everything, that's like a massively good deal. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. It's like, why would you not like, even if you can't drink that much, right? Yeah. yeah. Why would you not take that? Even if you'd like, at, I'm, at, I'm at like a brisk pace. Yeah. It's still yeah. good value for money. Yeah. Cause even yeah. like, say like, you know, it's like 500 yen for a beer. Yeah. Right? yeah. Even if you drink four beers in the two hours, you're yeah. still getting your money's worth. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like every time I'm just like, oh, I don't really feel like drinking that <laughs> yeah. much. Well, let's go to me hold I, 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 I remember when, uh, cause obviously when you move here, you kind of like stop wanting all you can drink. Cause you're like, it wears off. Yeah, but when, yeah. you, when the first few times I visited here, I remember thinking like treating it like an Olympic event. I'm like, all right, how many can I do in the two hour period? <laughs> no, cause, cause that's, that's what it would be like if there wasn't all you can drink in England. Right? No, it would be, yeah. That's how we think. Cause like, that's how we're wired. You're like, like, yeah. you're like 80% like speed running. Is like <laughs> I was, yeah, I was like, I was, I was like, Get the clock ready, Jerry. <laughs> time. Yeah, time. I remember I literally had this dilemma. I was like, I was drinking a beer and the first one I smashed it back. No problem. Yeah, yeah. This, easy. Second beer, I was like, shit, I'm, I'm two seconds off pace. <laughs> Like I remember, I, I actually remember being like, I'm one minute off the pace I, sh- I no, set myself. I, I, I was, I was like, like, exactly the same. You were like, how, if, if, how many how many beers do I need to drink to make this worth it? And how many can I go over? Yeah, You're yeah. like calculating this in your head to be like, okay, if I drink one beer every five to 10 minutes, then I, I can smash this many beers and I'd be like, earning back this amount of money. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're treating it like stocks. Cause, it's like, <laughs> cause we, we, I remember this, we, were, we I first came here as a tourist. We visited a bar that had 200 yen beers. Yeah. And I yeah. thought, okay, that's my new baseline yeah. for all you can drink. I need to make sure I get more of my money. Than, <laughs> I need to make sure it's more, better value than 200 yen a beer. Yeah. So I think we went to one that was like 2000 yen yeah. for two hours. And I was like, okay, in my head, I'm working it out. I'm it's like, like, okay. Yeah. So that's 10 beers in two I, hours. I need to get at least like, 10 beers. Yeah. yeah, so I was like, all right, I got to get 11. <laughs> just, to, just to get it under. So I feel like this was worth coming to. Yeah. And I remember I was in so much fucking pain on like the ninth beer yeah. that I got. Cause we were eating as well. Yeah, and, yeah. and my stomach was like, oh. <sighs> <laughs> because I think it was like eight beers in yeah. where I was like, I don't know if I forgot to tell you, but you can get other drinks too. Like it's not, it doesn't have to be just But I, I knew that pl- getting all you can drink like spirits was playing with fire. Oh yeah. And yeah. I would I would have been like on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, nah, I'll stick with beer. Cause beer is like the natural pace. Now I'm going to take you guys to the 50 yen beer place oh, because God, it's not God. an all you can drink, but it's 50 yen. I mean, it's 50 yen. So it might as well be all you can yeah, drink. Yeah, right. I because I, I feel like that's just the difference in mindset between anyone from like the West and people, <laughs> people in Japan, right? Because when anyone, anyone in the West comes over and hears all you can drink or all you can eat, it's it's a it's the it's same like, mindset where it's just like I've got I've got to fucking speed run this. I'm gonna <laughs> optimize this. What is the optimal speed run strats for, for this all you can drink? And Japanese people are just like, 
No, we just drink however much yeah. we feel like. I just like just, the pressure of not having yeah. to know how much I'm going to... Yeah, exactly. Because yeah, I think it works on like the trust system. Because yeah, yeah. yeah. I remember... We uh, trust you not to be a fucking alcoholic. Because <laughs> 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 that's why this would never work in any other country but like Japan, I yeah. feel. Because I remember I went to like... Uh, I went to this uh, kind of like... W- not, it wasn't a wine bar. What's like the place that they make wine? What's that called? Winery. Winery. <laughs> winery. That's that's the place. So I went to this winery with Sydney, um, just outside of Tokyo, um, and they basically had a cellar of about like a thousand different wines. Right, 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 right. And basically, you could you could sample as much as you as much as you like for ten bucks. Ten bucks. Nah, you had a cellar of nah, a that, thousand. That's wines. like that's got to be some Willy Wonka test. Dude. You know, <laughs> it's like if you actually go greedy, you're gonna like get yeah. killed. You're that, going into the wine. You're going right. into no, the no, cellar. It, it is totally You can right. drink as much of it as you want for ten okay, bucks. Okay, so you can sample as much of it. So every every <laughs> every <laughs> just sample. Every, every, every British people don't sample. <laughs> <drinks. laughs> that's that's exactly the point. That's exactly the point I'm trying to make. So uh, I so me and Sydney went in being like. The, the exact same mindset where it's like, there must be a catch. There must be a catch. Yeah. This, this can't be One true. of them is poison. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but so we go down there and, and they give us like this little cup, right? It's like yeah. the super small cup uh, where you can pour like, I'd say a third of a glass of wine into it. Okay. And these Japanese people were just pouring like one little drop, <laughs> like two little drops in there. Just like, just like letting, it, let, letting the drop like sit in their tongue. Yeah, yeah. And then we were just like, but we can draw. We can pour however much we want, right? So, so we in Sydney, like, because that's that's the thing. It, it's based on the trust system. Yeah, yeah. But you know, if if I you want to, them. but but if you want to, you can just pour however much you want for as many wines as you want, and no one is going to stop you, right? So there's so, something there's something similar to that that I saw in uh, oh fuck where was it? I think it was in Nagano yeah. when I went for mm. a trip. It was like a sponsored trip, and at the station because Nagano is kind of known for its sake. Yeah. There was exactly the same thing. It was like 50 to like a hundred <laughs> like barrels of all sorts of different sake. And it's like, yeah, yeah again, like- it was like one of everything. Yeah, it was like, yeah, it was like a thousand yen for like all you can test. All you right? can test. All you can, it's not all you can drink, it's all you can test. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> all you can sample. And yeah. I'm just like, Hell yeah! <laughs> but but there's nothing stopping you from sampling as much as you oh, like, yeah. right? I was like twenty down in, and I was like, I'm only a fifth of the way through yeah. this, and I'm about to fucking like. Faint. Imagine if you can ask for a free sample, but there's no one stopping you from asking for unlimited free samples. <laughs> you get unlimited free samples. That's basically the mindset. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it's like, so like we're here as a Westerner thinking we got the fucking cheat code to this. Yeah. So we we can it's just like it's like bottomless fries, but if you can go up and get your own fries, right? <laughs> it's like it's like having a buff in this country. It's like being British with the alcohol. It's like, yeah. oh shit, yeah. yeah. 